MTN's Cade Mentor has more on a vet recommended treatment that might help save pets' lives. In 2021, not only did Gray Falls see an increase in the amount of rattlesnakes, but local veterinarians said they had to deal with more snake bites. And with the nicer weather approaching, more pet owners are considering the rattlesnake vaccine. There have been an increase in, uh, last year was probably a bad year for rattlesnake bites, for one thing. Uh, because some of the rattlesnake bites were very close to town, I think word of, word of mouth uh, it, the word spread and a lot more people got their dogs uh, vaccinated for it because of the increase in rattlesnake bites. The idea behind the vaccine? The rattlesnake vaccine is designed to build immunity against a rattlesnake bite for your dogs. Um, so the idea behind it is that when if or when your pet would get bit by a snake, then they would have some immunity of their own to that to be able to fight that bite, um, hopefully causing less of a severe reaction and buying you time to get to a veterinarian. Although recommended by many veterinarians, it's still in the early stages of development. Veterinarians acknowledge that more clinical trials need to be done, which is why it's not a recommended core vaccine like rabies. But for those looking to head outdoors this summer season, the vaccine will be offered if requested. I do recommend it on a case-by-case -case basis. Um, and so what that means is I would recommend it if you are um, hiking, camping, fishing, going hunting, um, anything like that, then I would definitely recommend you talk to your veterinarian and see if it's right for your pet. After speaking with veterinarians, they all said while the rattlesnake vaccine may be recommended, it is also important to discuss this with your local vet. Other ways to prevent a snake bite is also to keep your pet on a leash and be mindful of location. April through October, you are more likely to see these snakes. In Great Falls, Cade Mentor, MTN News.